What's up my nuggets, Mr. Phantasmo here, and today we have a demolition on WMD, um, which in case you guys didn't know, that actually means Wiener's Most Delicious, and I just made that up, and I feel like I probably shouldn't have said that. Um, yeah, I don't know, maybe some of you think Wiener's are... Um, so, this is a demolition game. Um, this is one of my first demolition games that I've played um, on Black Ops. This is kind of old for me, I guess. I don't know. Um, I haven't even prestiged yet in this, so that's why I say it's kind of old. And as you can see right there, I actually pressed start um, to um, find out where the bomb sites were. And I threw that grenade. That will never kill anyone, by the way, in case you were wondering. Um, if you were trying to get a spawn nade, uh, don't copy that. Um, like I said, I don't know. I was, I was, it was very new to this uh, game type on this map. Um, I was kind of very new to this map altogether, I guess. But um, anyways, that's not the point. All you need to know is that I was kind of newbie in this game. But I thought I'd show it. Um, first reason being that I have a machinima post up where I play. Look at this. I lay down right here, and I thought I was right by the bottom. I was like, oh, I thought you were so much closer than you really were. But um, anyways, I have a machinima post up. Um, and it's playing demolition, so, and it's actually a, um, later version, um, I, I think I'm like second prestige in that video. Um, so yeah, my tactics are a little bit more improved, um, I, I pick up, I go ahead and pick up the tactical insertion over the claymore, and I just, I don't know, it, watching this first and then going to watch that one on Machinima, you can, you kinda can notice, um, my change in techniques and the way I go about things, but, um, I also wanted to bring up the fact that I was thinking about starting a new series, or maybe not a series, but just like the way that I start to play games uh, more often than not, and that is to, you know, completely go, go for the objective. And now here I am planting the bomb, and I, you know, I didn't defend it that well before, but, you know, I'm planting the bomb, and I'm trying to play some sort of the objective, but I find more times than not I'm, you know, when I'm going... When I'm playing, I'm thinking about getting games for you guys to watch, and it just seems that um, in order to do that, I kind of have to stray away from the objective to get more kills because I feel like, you know, the uh, the gaming society that we live in today, that kind of sounded that sounded really dumb, but you know, it, the, the the way everyone expects games to go is for you to get like a hundred to one kill to death ratio and you know play the objective, and it, it's really you know it's one way or the other unless you have a super super good game. So I was thinking about showing um, games, you know, uh, objective type games where you actually play the objective. I know it sounds really funny and weird, but um, that's what you're supposed to do. So um, let me know if you guys uh, like that. I was thinking about calling it like Tasmo Tactics or something stupid like that. But um, and these guys have just caught them with their pants down. Um, so I went ahead and. Uh, did things to them. I, don't, I should just stop talking. Every time I get an idea in my head, I should just instantly pick it out of my ear and flick it at somebody because it's just no good. But um, yeah, so just let me know, guys. Let me know if you think that'd be a good idea. I don't know. I feel like, like I said, when I'm when I'm playing these objective type games, it's like you know, you're, it's close to Thanksgiving, so I guess I'll make a Thanksgiving reference, um, even though my references tend to never make sense, but um, let's just say you really like mashed potatoes, and they're all passing the mashed potatoes around, um, which would be like, you know, the kills, the amount of kills that everyone should get are the mashed potatoes, but you really like mashed potatoes, so you, instead of getting the vegetables, you know, getting your fair share of vegetables, which would be playing the objective, because no one really likes to play the objective, but it has to get done. You know, it's it's a healthy thing to do. I don't know. This 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 uh, this um, relationship is actually making more and more sense as I go along. But let's just say you you take more than your fair share of mashed potatoes, and then everyone else gets mad at you because there's no mashed potatoes left. But the people watching you eat the mashed potatoes like you more because you stole more mashed potatoes. Yeah. So, moral of the story is, you should eat your vegetables, and you should also tell me if you want to watch me play um, more objective-based. Um, just overall, I mean, I, I'm, of course, when I'm playing Team Deathmatch and Free For All, that will be more of the, you know, killing as many people as I can because that's the objective, but um, I don't know. I just, I've been playing a lot with my, uh, with my clan. I don't know. We're not, I guess we're a clan, but... Um, you know, just just with my friends and everything, and I, I haven't really even touched free for all to be honest, or team deathmatch. I think I've maybe played like I don't know 20 games, maybe at most. 
Um, and I've just been playing, you know, all these. I've been jumping into Team Tactical a lot, which is another thing I wanted to bring up. I don't know if you guys uh, were interested in seeing Team Tactical. The only reason I've kind of strayed away, and right here, I totally get all my kills jacked for me. That guy, and that guy, and that guy. Like, I don't even get a, I don't even get an assist. I was kind of crying right there, but, um, but yeah, anyways, Team Tactical scores, um, although they seem, for me, more fun to watch because they're more competitive, I feel like, uh, better players play on Team Tactical, but, um, the scores aren't obviously going to be as big because you're only fighting against four people, whereas, you know, you could, in other game modes, you could be fighting against six and nine people, so, um, let me know if you guys would like to see Team Tactical. I know I'm asking you guys a lot of what you want to see, and, you know, even if no one responded at all, I'd still keep posting, but I just, I really want to, uh, you know, change up my channel and kind of, you know, make it, make it just more original. I wanted to start up some series, series, some series, yeah, I want to start up, like, a couple series and stuff like that, and just, I don't know. I really want to, uh, change it up for Black Ops. I don't know why, I'm just get into some kind of mood sometimes so yeah I don't really know how to explain it but um so yeah if, if this is annoying to you me, me constantly pulling you I'm sorry but you know it's for your benefit it's for your own good so um as you can see I did release the dogs and the dogs um did a lot of work for me the, these dogs are just like in, insanely good in this game I can't really uh I can't really stress enough I mean I haven't I think I've used the gunship like twice but the dogs, in my opinion, are just it's so much more powerful than the gunship, um, especially if you're good with your gun, which I guess in order to get the dogs, you would have to be good with your gun. Uh, but just because you can, you can let them go out and, you know, munch on people while you're munching on people, and you can just get, uh, it feels like you can get twice as much kills as you can with the gunship. And right here, see, I should have gone and went to defuse that bomb, but I stay here, and I know this guy's coming, but he also knew that I was right there, and he was just... He was just counting me out the whole time. He knew every step I was taking. So, um, yeah, should have definitely gone and defused that bomb because, um, you know, I, I. But like I said, sometimes I just don't think team oriented. But um, you know, bottom line, I'm always gonna go for the objective and I'm always gonna try for the win because um, that's just my nature. But um, my first objective is if my team is good and everything, I'm going to want to just go and uh, kill everyone which is you know not necessarily a bad thing especially if you're running with an entire squad to have like a slayer on your team that just kind of gets in their spawn and messes them up so they can't either plant or defuse the bombs uh, that's kind of a good thing but you also you know I don't know I don't really know what I'm saying anymore I feel like I probably re repeated myself several times in that commentary but if you guys got the gist of it um, leave your thoughts and everything in the comment section and I will read them and um, act accordingly, I guess. I don't know. Uh, but other than that, guys, oh, and be sure to check out my Machinima video. I'm pretty sure I brought that up. Um, but other than that, uh, peace, Nuggets.